This riff is by a beautiful artist uh, named Ed Sheeran. Uh, it's off one of his earlier albums. It's called Autumn Leaves. Now, it's a beautiful little riff he's come up with. Uh, he uses a capo on the second fret, so as you can see, I've stuck it on here. Um, making it sound like it's in a different key to what you play it in. Like, you're actually playing as if you're in E minor, but because of the capo, we're up to, so we're in F sharp minor. So the scale would sound like... So that would be your scale. Now, pretty well, it's just this pedal tone where you're going to put your finger here on this note. Now, I'm going to call it a D. It's not really a D, it's an E because of the capo. But we'll assume we're doing it without the capo. So that would be the D. And what we're always going to do is do a bass note, which will be with your thumb. Then we're going to pick the third string, the second string, then back to the third again. So I would suggest you use your thumb to play the bottom note, then your index, your middle, then your index. So you get this pattern and it, it just going. And all I'm doing is leaving that finger there on that D note. Now we're just going to change the bass notes around. So it's basically going up the scale. You're just doing that first note of the scale, second of the scale, third of the scale, and then the sixth of the scale. Now the riff is basically the same for most of the song. He does alternate the bass and in the chorus he reverses it. He goes down from this G, so it actually modulates more to the relative major. So the G becomes the tonic and it goes G bass, F sharp, the E, and then back to that C, which is the four of the scale. Now he does this cool little riff on the first time through it. I'll just show you that. So after you've done the bass note, the second of the scale, the third, he does this riff, here we go. So what I'm doing there is I'm playing this bass note, then I pick my third string like normal, then I'm gonna pick my fourth string, and I'm gonna hammer down on the second fret here. And then I'm gonna finish off by picking the third, then the second string. Now the riff is all quaver rhythm, so quavers is just two per beat where you're getting a rhythm going one and two and three and four and except if you're playing that little riff there. When you're doing that, we're going one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four E and up. So you get these semi-quavers on that fourth beat. Four E and up. So in context, it'd be. Very beautiful little riff there. So, so, so that's just a hammer on there. Now the tempo of the song is about 100 beats a minute, so I'll just play through it once or twice and hopefully you can make sense of this one. Now I'll put the riff in. Now the chorus. That's Ed Sheeran's Autumn Leaves.